could I ask you to present yourself? Uh, nice to meet you. My name is Anna Luisek. I come from Barcelona and I am currently the general manager of Ola Boutique Hotels. So how did you come to, uh, to, to, to this hotel? What did you do in your life? What, uh, what was your path? Well, um, I started very young at this industry. Uh, at the age of 16, I started as a waitress in a, hotel, a very small hotel in my hometown. And I work in different departments and in different hotels during my career path. And I have to confess that since the beginning, I've been held uh, an admiration to this industry. Um, I work as a driver in a hotel, I work as an assistant in a kitchen, I work uh, as a sales manager in the quality department, uh, organizing uh, banquetings and events. I, I think I do as much as I can, someone can do in a hotel. And this was, this was very exciting and it helps me a lot to understand how demanding and hard and sometimes invisible is uh, these jobs. Uh, because many people link hotels uh, to red carpets and glamour, but the majority of the time it means long hours, hard work and very demanding uh, situations. But I'm very proud of working uh, in this industry. And I started in Ola Hotels in 2010. Uh, I worked for a company very consolidated in Catalonia, but they had only hotels on the coast and they wanted to expand uh, these uh, data sets to Barcelona. And they hired me in 2010 to open the first Ola in Barcelona. And since then, I'm very proud of being created uh, the brand of Ola Hotels. Wow, so you are really, you've been there since the beginning, which is great. You, you could create uh, all this house. Uh, how did you do? Uh, what was the important, what were important steps? Um, for me, the most important thing when I wanted to create the Ola brand was to build a motivated, uh, a motivated team because that I think that the staff is the most valuable asset for any success. So I was um, responsible for hiring my team and together we have been able to create the Ola brand. We, um, we made a lot of brain, long brainstorming uh, meetings uh, in order to create new experiences, new things, because we wanted to have new, another concept of five-star hotels in Barcelona. What is this concept? Or how, how are five-star hotels in Barcelona and in what is uh, your hotel different? I think I should describe our hotels in four words. Um, our architecture, we, uh, both hotels are very emblematic. Uh, the second point could be uh, the uh, modern and avant-garde interior design. Uh, one of the topics is uh, our showers. Some rooms have the shower in the middle of the room. And it is very, uh, very new and, and for many of our guests. And the third thing could be the high gastronomy. We are very proud of having excellent chefs in our hotels. In Ola Barcelona we have Romain Fornay and in Ola Champla uh, our chef is um, Fran Lopez. Both of them excellent, very expertise, awarded by Michelin star and with different cuisines, different gastronomies. And the fourth point is my team. I'm very proud of them, of them and I think that all our success is because of them. And I try to deal, to, to, to lead by example, and I want to be with them and for them. So somehow I think you described also uh, what is important uh, for hotel business today, or uh, what are like the new tendencies, or how is the hotel industry uh, nowadays? Uh, the hotel industry um, is changing a lot. I, I, if we 
um, for example, five, maybe ten years ago, um, a guest who wanted to stay in a five-star hotel, in a luxury hotel, expected to find uh, velvet, velvet curtains, carpets everywhere, uh, huge rooms. Nowadays, they wanted to 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 find new experiences. Uh, we, wow, experiences! Something to 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 share with their friends and families through social media. And from the beginning to the checkout during their stay, they wanted to, to use technology to, to be in contact with us uh, everywhere and very fast. And new experiences in gastronomy. So I think that they don't only want to stay in a, in a comfort hotel, they expected something more. Wow, and what are your dreams? Or what is the thing you would really like to do? Wow, you, you never know what the uh, future will bring you. However, I like to keep working in, in hospitality because it's not only my job, it's, it's my life. And how do you feel today to have this prize and to wow. be here? <laughs> I'm very excited, I'm very happy because um, it's important that someone uh, decide to nominate you and to, to decide that your career path deserves this award. So I'm very, very happy. I'm very and proud. Maybe the last question, because you are the only woman. Then, <laughs> so how, how is it to be a woman in this industry? Well, sometimes it's very difficult because I think that you, you have to work harder than them. But um, I think that things are changing. Uh, in my team, I have many women. In my hotels, we, I, we have more women than men. So I'm sure that in the near future, things will go are going to change. So it's also gender-equilibrated hotel, let's say. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much. It's a pleasure.